Hello, this is Mr. Buffington, and this week I actually was building a chicken coop, and I needed to do a little bit of math to figure out the surface area so that I could buy the right amount of chicken wire so that my chickens don't run away and, you know, the foxes don't eat them and things like that. So what I have here is a drawing of about what my chicken yard looks like. So it's 32 feet across, and then it's 6 feet tall, and 16 feet here in length. So what I needed to do was to buy enough chicken wire that I could wrap it around all sides of this chicken fence. And some people like to cover over the top, so I wanted to make sure I had enough chicken wire so that I could cover the whole thing should, you know, I need to, you know, keep the chickens in, bad animals out. <laughs> all right, so here's what I needed to do. I needed to find the surface area of this entire rectangular prism. And the surface area is equal to the lateral area, or in other words, the area of the upright sides, and that's what I would definitely need to fence in. And then also the surface area of the top. So I'll call that, I'll put a little T down there for the surface area of the top. All right. So my total surface area is equal to the lateral area plus the surface area of this top rectangle. The lateral area is found by adding the perimeter, or multiplying, I'm sorry, the perimeter times the height. And the reason we do that, it's like we're extending this side and this side and the other two sides out into being a really long rectangle, the length of the perimeter, which makes sense. And then we multiply that length times the height that we have. So I have 16, 32, 16, and 32, right? So my perimeter is equal to 2 times the length plus 2 times the width. That's my perimeter, and we're going to multiply the perimeter times the height. And that will give us our lateral area. The next part is that we have to find the area of this rectangle up top, which is 32 feet by 16 feet. All right, and that's going to give us our total surface area. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of math here. 32 times 2 is 64. 2 times 16 is 32. We're going to multiply that times 6 plus 32 times 16. This is going to give us our total surface area. 32 and 64 is 96 times 6 plus 32 times 16. 96 times 6 is 576 and 32 times 16 is 512 and when we add those together, we get 1,088. I don't know if you can see that very clearly, but 1,088 square feet. So we've discovered the lateral surface area and then also the surface area of the top. So if I want to get enough chicken wire, I'm going to have to get 1,000, more than 1,088 square feet of, of chicken wire. So here are my chickens. I got the coop finished. And as you can see around the outside here, uh, if I show you, I didn't run out of chicken wire. We had enough to do the whole thing because we used our equations and we found out how much stuff we needed. So say goodbye to the chickens. But there they are, happy inside their house. And they're not gonna be able to get away and no animals hopefully can come in because we used math properly. <laughs> well, I'll see you guys next week and have a wonderful day.